This looks like a nice graph. Let me zoom in. between an undefined value and dividing a fraction by zero, let's look at this question right here. y equals to x plus one over x squared minus one. This is an equation. A lot of you guys will immediately do this. x plus one over, this is your like your a squared minus b squared formula. And when you expand it, you'll get x plus one, x minus one. Then what do you guys do? You take, you cancel these two things and you're left with one over x minus one. So when you're trying to find the asymptote, it is called dividing by zero, which basically occurs when the numerator does not equal to zero, while the denominator is equal to zero. In this case, one over zero will be called dividing by zero when x is equal to one, because this will make the denominator zero. However, guys, there's a catch. The denominator oh, is no. that this function has an undefined value. And basically, what is an undefined value? You take numerator is equal to zero and denominator is equal to zero. Let's demarcate this. So guys, let's try to analyze together this equation. Let's bring the denominator over. x plus one, x minus one, y, which is very obvious. You get this, correct? Now, what are you doing when you are cancelling, which you must understand, is that you are dividing both sides by the term you're cancelling, which is x plus one. And math works in that you can't divide something by zero because it doesn't exist. So this thing must not be equal to zero. This thing right here must not be equal to zero. Because it can't divide by zero, this condition must hold. Now, if you bring the one over, you get x does not equal to minus one. So at this point, this is an undefined value. And why is this case? Put minus one in the original equation. Y is equals to minus one plus one divided by minus one squared minus one, which would give you zero over zero, which is undefined. So guys, when you look at the graph of Y equals X plus one over X squared minus one, the asymptote, which is X equals to one, is right here, correct? And then x does not equal to minus 1, which you'll take note of. Now, how do you find a horizontal asymptote? I'll be explaining it in the next video in detail, so please stay tuned. But in this case, it's y is equal to 0. Now, if we were to draw the graph, it will look like this. The asymptotes right here. However, there's this point, x equals to minus 1, somewhere right here, where this point is undefined. Which means that this will be like minus 1 undefined. There's no value for y. The function doesn't hold. So let's recap the main points. Dividing by 0 is when the numerator does not equal to 0, but the denominator is equal to 0. Undefined value means that the numerator is 0 and the denominator is 0. So guys, we use this to find the vertical asymptote x equals to 1. And for this function, we found the undefined value when num is equal to zero and denominator is equal to zero, which is x does not equal to minus one. And the most important point is that you make sure that when you're cancelling these two terms, does not equal to zero. Unless you state in the question already, then you don't need to care about that. So here you have it, man. Do subscribe and stay tuned for my next video on horizontal asymptotes.